Oh, I guess I should have been recording this travel. See, I for some reason every enemy between here and there had respawned. I don't know why, but it had happened, and it kind of ended with my doom because I was not expecting this at all. Anyway, welcome back to Dark Souls with yours truly, Lord of the Mad. Hi, Lord of Losses, Harbinger, Spiffening, Bella 22, Boxes Man, and Cutest Wacky Dealers 13, and all around Neutral Guy. It's time for me to go and retrieve my souls because there's like 9,000 of them. It's a good thing I know this area well enough not to die here again, hopefully. Hopefully. No, don't do that. Silly bugger. Alright, get the souls. I wonder what I can get with. 10,000 souls when it comes to pyromancers. If there really is anything interesting about that. Yeah, the armored guy got me after I fell off the bloody bridge and onto him. Only had enough health to be stabbed once, apparently. Which happened. I was stabbed once. There we go. Not according to plan, apparently. Hello. Didn't think to spin. Well, I see you made it out. Yeah, I, I made it out safely too. I have my pyromancy in the Great Swamp, so I can use my hands with a bit of care. Oh yeah, by the way, uh, I can share my spells with you. I think you have a knack for it, all you need are the materials. I'd be pleased to help you. Ah, uh, unless you find the magic's unsavory? Yes. Oh, really? Oh, oh no. Is, but it, uh, I'm on the fringe. Yeah, I know. I, I'm dead or not, that's who I am. I only wish that, that, that I could have repaid you somehow. We can talk again. Sorry. I kind of went with the wrong answer. Yeah. I'm pleased to see you safe. Oh, and uh, if by chance you've had a change of hearts, I'll be pleased to assist you by sharing my spell. Now do I answer yes. Yeah, wonderful. I'm sure that you know, they'll be of some use, some assistance. Well, let's get started right now. Yay, modify equipment. Pyromancy flame. Wait. Maybe I should look at the possible pyromancies as well. Fire orb. Six slots. Uh, six uses, that is. Combustion. I kind of want to see the alternatives. Ooh. Well, fireball is the one I have now. This seems... These two seem like the options which I should really look into. Though these... Oh, this should actually be something I could to use to get past the dragon, I guess. But for now, this is what I'm going with. Thank you. Goodbye, then. Come back if you find anything new. Oh no, let's talk. I mean, let's rest. Attune magic. Slot number two is getting fire orb. Oh yeah. Excellent. Which means I can now do this. Switch between spells. Yeah. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Oh, I should also have enough souls to repair my shit. So, uh, let's do that. And, oh, I will still have enough souls to upgrade my pyromancy flame even further. So, that also sounds pretty good. Okay. Teach me. Oh, hello there. I'm pleased to see you safe, as always. Provide the materials, I can teach you pyromancy. Spiffy. Pyromancy Flame 2. Oh, yeah. Goodbye then. Come back if you find anything new. Now, I need to find a situation where I can put these things to practice. The fire orb, I mean. If that splash damage. Oh, it might be really useful up there, actually, in the depths. That's down there. 
I'm bad with directions. Oh yeah. Most certainly so. Get that guy. Then that guy. Oh, fire. Shit. You didn't even think to stab. Well, at least I survived. So, there's that. Am I still fighting someone? Did the guy die? There are three corpses, so I must assume so. Yeah. I have a sip and ignore the rat, because the rat is difficult to reach with this weapon. That's the only problem, really. This corridor is too tight to use with this sword. Well, the corridor is too tight for the sword to be used. That's the one. Though I am still very much uncertain why every single enemy between here and there had survived respawned the last time. I did, hadn't rested anywhere? Did defeating the Capra Demon on the first try respawn everything then? No it didn't. They must have respawned after the deaths. I still don't know why. Let's get that as well. Oh! Got an attack in before it died. How rude. Alright, to the depths. Not the friendliest of places, I'll assure you of that. But other than that, could be fun. No? There we go. I kind of want to try a fire orb. How large is the splash damage? This large? No smaller than that. Okay. But I have access to multiple fire magics now, so there's that. It's all good. Maybe you should be shield for this situation, might be wise. Well, so is torching apparently. Alright, so... What we have here are a couple of hounds. Not too worrisome. I said you're not too worrisome, don't do that. Bit where you're worrisome actually. Um, that's the butcher dead with his hound. So now we have two hounds down there. Uh, wait, no. Yeah, that's the right thing. That's the right thing. There we go. Burn the dog to death. And uh, then we have that guy. And the second hound. Which is what I want to deal with right now. Can't I lock onto it? It's right over there. There we go. Much less trouble with them when I just fireball. And much less trouble with that if I just run. Uh, I might want to switch to a shield until I find the butcher at least. It shouldn't be too difficult to find there. Oh, it snuck up behind me. Where did you come from? Got a, got a night show. Will this work? Yeah, good. That was unwise. Drink up. And run. We're going up here, though it doesn't really affect this battle as much. Where is he? Didn't have given up, could he? No way. I think he was a stubborn bastard. 
Which here? Which here? There's no way I'm actually stealth in the water. Is he over there? Where is he over there? Where did he even come from? I didn't see any sur surface from him to jump down from. Okay, he's over there now. Being gone to open up. Nope, nope, nope. Not doing that. Not the way I've been playing this. Sorry very much. Wait. There we go, that's how we blink this. Yeah. Now we have a sack. What does the sack do? Uh, it can apparently be exchanged for some other item. Uh, but I don't know what that is right now. Not gonna wear a sack right now, though. I still don't think I have the great capacity for it. Alright, now, I'm not really sure what direction I should be heading in. Ah, this sounds fine. This sounds fine, yeah. This is a trap, though. There is a slime thing on the ceiling. There's a slime thing on the ceiling. No, 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 no. I cannot target it, though. Why can I not target it? There we go. How does it react to fire, I wonder? Tell me. Well, that would have been nice to know before. Now. Oh, I have the souls. I have the souls to kindle the bonfire. Good. Because I'm gonna need this bonfire. So, if I make them all drop and use a fire orb, would that help? They only drop in waves of free, though. Come on, don't you want to chase me? You usually kinda want to chase me. In this too. I know it don't kill the first one. But does it matter I will be able to refill my magics anyway? So there's that. Alright, so the next three. Can I aim for the ceiling with fireball? Yes, they can even hit with that. Nice. Wait, no, no, no. Got the way around. Can I not aim for the other slimes? Apparently not. I suppose they may have been too close. Burn. Burn! Oh, nice. Uh, that didn't burn. That still didn't burn. Yo, what's your major dysfunction, slime? Why did you not burn? Hey, don't do that. I'm gonna try to make this burn. But well, no, I'm not. I was initially planning to make it burn. Oh, well. Oh, God, it's locked. Right. Well, uh, that kind of complicates matters, doesn't it? Hi, Rat. I suppose I'm going this way then. Uh, where was the key? Did the rats have it? I think the rats had it. 
Anyway, thanks for watching and see you next time. Where I will fight the rats. <laughs>